Hello viewers, I'm back. So, this time I'm posting something different. So I've been very much a fan of the James Webb Space Telescope, which was launched in December 2021. And now it has released its first pictures, what I will show you today. So this, this first pictures, and the, these old pictures are roughly 25 megapixel uh, that I downloaded from NASA page. Yeah? And uh, you can see that there is so much detail visible with this James Webb Space Telescope. Yeah? Never before yeah, in the history of humankind, we, we have been able to look at such a detailed pictures. For this example, this is Carina Nebula. Yeah? It shows millions of stars. And these stars which have spikes, yeah? these are basically stars in our galaxy. But the nebula, this the orange stuff, is the mostly dust, and other stars. So everything which is really small here with, with, without spikes, there are either galaxies or something else. So this is magnificent. Yeah? These gold-plated, I think 16 mirrors that are available of Jin Space Telescope will be able to reveal so much about the universe that we couldn't even imagine before. And uh, yeah, for example, this is now the Planetary Nebula, NGC, yeah? with uh, I think it represents the bird of a new star in the middle and some kind of a dust that it's spreading around also and it's difficult to know exactly i think that astronomers would know much more in detail what really is behind all this stuff and also this example image is this interacting galaxy so basically three galaxies touching one another but i assume that you wouldn't be able to see the other galaxy if you're in one of them because this is so, so big and so, so huge. This is the example with our Milky Way. You hardly can see the entire galaxy in the pure night. And this would be the same. And everything around these small smudges are also galaxies, thousands and millions of them, I, I would suppose. And this is the deep field picture. Uh, this represents, I don't know, how many thousands of galaxies here. And these smudges, and you can see that it's not uh, bright or clear enough because gravita gravitational lensing, yeah, what I think already Newton uh, calculated it, it appears, uh, because this is why some uh, s galaxies appear smudgy in this picture, but it's so many of them, yeah, this is so, so far away. I think that it was mentioned that it's 13 billion light years away, the most distant galaxies in this image shown. So this is insane, entirely insane. And the last image is the exoplanet. Yeah, so this is, we won't be able to see this planet because it's so small and tiny. And these dots on this graph presents the, let's say, decrease of the light in the spectrum analysis from which scientists can even find out which kind of atmosphere has this planet. Yeah. So this is the future, what will bring us the James Webb Space Telescope. So thank you for watching and stay tuned for more.